the best method for farming cursed chests before the third seed would be just staying on a small island, waiting every six minutes for a new one to spawn for you. And if you're on the third seed, you would probably be going to the haunted castle, I mean the haunted boat, and just killing the enemies there since they spawn bones. And then every six minutes just looking around for the cursed chest. So you'll be getting even more bones that way. Though if you're on the first or second sea, you are gonna want to be on a small island. Because every six minutes or so, a cursed chest will spawn for you and you alone. Like, there's a cursed chest right there for him. Or, I mean, for me, it's my alt account. Like, right there. But I can't see it on this account. But it's still there. And the enemies are gonna scale off of my level. They're only level 25, but they hurt. Oh my god. I just killed my alt account. Oh yeah, because you can't hurt the enemy spawned by another person. Anyway, the reason it works like that is because it's client side. It only spawns for you, and it's always every about six minutes? I believe that's the time. And sadly, it keeps track of your time even if you leave the server. So if I server hop and go to another server after grabbing this chest, I'll still have to wait another six minutes. Though, it likes to spawn on the island you're on, since it only spawns for you. So staying on a small island that doesn't have a lot of chests makes it very easy to find these things. It will also follow you, so you don't really have to worry about missing it. Like right now, it's, it's here, but it's gonna despawn when I go over to the jungle island. Because it's gonna spawn on the jungle island, so it's gonna leave right there. Someone's over there. And as... Well, I'm not sure what it is there. But as I get over to the jungle... The cursed uh, chest is now over here, somewhere. I'm gonna have to look around here. Yeah, probably shouldn't have gone over here. The jungle is not as good as the middle island for finding all the chests, since they're more split out over here. It was hidden behind the wall. But yeah, a lot of these chests are hidden over here, so the middle island is a much better place for getting the cursed chests. And then, of course, the enemies are a different level. They're 1820. Yep. One level higher than mine. Did I just hit him? I don't know. Oh, he just spawned his own. Okay. And now, as far as what they can drop, the, they can drop 50 fragments, they can drop 10 minutes of double XP, and I've heard they can drop a fruit, but I haven't actually seen that yet, so I'm not sure if that's true. And then, of course, the, way, uh, the place you spend them is just right over here. Also at the cafe in the second sea of your wonder. You can gamble, you can do a stat refund, crap like that. Now, the gambling is always just gonna... <laughs> I mean, it could give you something good, but it's usually gonna give you garbage like that. Yeah, that's not good. Though, yeah, that was just a quick, basic explanation to the cursed chest, how they work, and how to get them.